Hi, my name is Rand. I'm the CEO here at Zama. And today I would like to show you our homomorphic EVM smart contract capabilities. We've implemented a set of precompiles that enables you to have those FHE uints as a new data type in Solidity on which you can do encrypted arithmetics on chain. For example, if I have an ERC20 contract and I want to protect the balances, I would replace the integer by an encrypted integer in the balance here. And then for the transfer, I would have an encrypted amount, do an encrypted require check, an encrypted addition, and a homomorphic subtraction. If I want to allow specific users to view the balance, I can define all the access control logic of who can decrypt which value that's on the blockchain simply by writing Solidity code. In this case here, just enabling the user to see their own balance, but nothing else. I'm gonna compile that. I'm just using the traditional Remix tools, nothing new here. And I'm gonna deploy it to the Zama testnet using MetaMask. Contract is deployed. I'll just copy it. And I'm gonna be using Zama's test web app, uh, pasting the contract address here, confirming. You can see the contract has no tokens minted yet. So I'm gonna go ahead and mint two tokens. What happens behind the scenes is that I will actually encrypt the value two using the network's public key and produce a zero knowledge proof that I know the value I just sent to the network. This is important for security reasons to avoid people decrypting arbitrary values. Transaction is validated now. If I refresh, I can ask to see my own balance, popping MetaMask request to confirm decryption. We integrated everything into MetaMask to make sure that the user experience is absolutely seamless using MetaMask snaps. You can see here that I've got two narrows in my balance now. Let's now transfer a token to Bob. I'm pasting Bob's address, sending him one token. Again, encrypting the value one, generating a ZK proof, and confirming using my MetaMask. Transaction is done. If I switch to Bob's account and ask to decrypt his balance, you can see the balance of Bob is now one Nara token. If we now look on chain at the transaction itself, we can see that this is a very normal EVM transaction, but this time the actual data on chain is an encrypted blob of randomness. Even though I transferred a token to Bob, nobody can tell how many tokens I have in my balance and how many tokens were just transferred. This of course is not limited to tokens. Any kind of application can be built using those homomorphic integer data types blind auctions, mixed nets, on-chain randomness for games, on-chain games where you have to keep secrets, identity KYC checks on-chain, everything is possible just writing simple Solidity code. Thank you. My name is Rand. You can contact me at rand@zama.ai.